The rivalry between Henry Cejudo and Brandon Moreno has deep roots in the world of MMA. And today, we're exploring how it all began. It all started on The Ultimate Fighter, when Henry Cejudo was chosen as a coach. He picked the number one flyweight. Yo mentalmente yo estaba con que, yo voy a estar con que en nuestro equipo, o sea, no había otro camino. Alright brother, you're up. Pick. Alex Pantoja. A decision that left his training partner Brandon Moreno out of the mix. We had no idea how the seedings were, so if I picked the number one seed, the number 16 seed was going to the opposite side. Brandon Moreno. This choice would ultimately lead to Moreno being eliminated from the competition by that very same fighter. While competing on the show, Brandon formed a strong friendship with his coach, Joseph Benavidez. As they trained together, Moreno supported Benavidez in preparation for his fight against none other than Henry Cejudo. This marked a turning point in their relationship. Fight camp, I found out that they were actually training together. So I'm just like, damn. Like, what I did, it was like it was wrong. It, 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 it was an accident I w that wasn't meant to be. He no longer became my friend. Fast forward to Brandon's only loss in his quadrilogy with Figgy. And who will you see in Figgy's corner? You guessed it, Henry Cejudo. I'm gonna be in the corner with Davison? I know how to be Brandon, on top of all that. I really do. He's the same, he's the exact same fighter since I first saw him. Same combinations, same stance, same everything. No me sorprendió nada, o sea, si realmente se está haciendo todo por tratar de afectar mi carrera, son personas que pues, no se pueden llamar tus amigas, ¿no? Y, y así lo dejo. Once close friends, Cejudo and Moreno have seen their relationship deteriorate through the sport they both love. It's a classic story of rivalry, fueled by competition. With their history and unresolved issues, fans are wondering, isn't it time for these two to step into the octagon? A fight could not only settle their differences, but also pave the way for a potential reconciliation. Well, maybe after this fight, maybe after we win, I think we should talk about it. I don't, I don't want him to feel like that towards me. We can talk about it, whether he wins or he loses. Sports is about coming together and then hash it out. Because we were friends at one point. As the MMA world watches, the question remains. Will we see Cejudo and Moreno face off? Only time will tell, but one thing is clear. This matchup is a must-see for any fan. What do you think? Should these two settle the score in the octagon? Share your thoughts in the comments.